everyone. My name is Sandy. Thank you so much for stopping by my website. Today I just wanted to take the opportunity to show you about what I'm going to be launching in Prince George here for the women and for the community and I'm so excited to show you my studio. We've been working so hard over the last few months doing this and preparing this for the community and so I just wanted to give you a quick tour. So here you can see we have the fireplace, which will keep us nice and cozy in the warm, not the warm winter months, the cold winter months. <laughs> it's going to be warm in here though. I promise you this will keep us nice and cozy. And along here, as you can see, this is the working area where the students that come here will be playing and having fun and learning and connecting and lots of laughter and learning and it's just going to be a great time. So there will be room enough as you can see for six participants for each class or workshop. And then over here I have my collection of rubber stamps. Don't judge me. I have a little bit of an addiction to rubber stamps and this is my lifetime collection like that's going to make a difference. So over here, all of my rubber stamps are organized and put in order. This is the people. And then there's nature and animals and occasions. And I can go on and on. But I just wanted to show you some of my favorite drawers for now. And when you come over, you can come and see them for yourself. And also you'll be able to use them in your projects when you bring them or if we use them in some of the classes too as well. So those are all my rubber stamps. And then over here are my little mixed media goodies that I hope will tantalize you and inspire you. And these are just lots of little doodads that I've picked up through the years because you just never know what you're going to need when you're a mixed media artist. Yes, it's just, it just makes me happy when I look at all of that stuff. So. But we'll, we'll carry on. And here's my fiber collection, my beautiful fiber collection. And this is a really great way, I thought, to, to uh, display them. And then we can just come over here and cut them off and use them in our projects. Or we can make beautiful curtains. <laughs> and over here we have the bookcase here that has all kinds of books for you to come over and enjoy and look at and just have a cup of tea and relax. And some of the books that I have here on the bookshelf, this is all of my books about how to make journals. These are art journaling books, how once they're made, what you can do with them. And in here is my collage and mixed media books and I can go on and on, but you can come anytime and like I said, come and take a look at them and see if there's anything that you like. Over here I have my paper collection. Some papers I've made and mostly there's lots that I've bought. And I was really quite surprised when I unpacked all of my papers at once as to how many I had. But that's okay. We'll be using them in the studio anyhow. And over here I've got another bookshelf full of ribbon and my own personal journals that you're welcome to go through and just get some ideas to see how I um, personally do my art journaling. And then in here I've got all kinds of uh, magazines for rubber stamping and mixed media and you name it. I have it. And they're just full, 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 full of magazines that you're welcome to come through here and look at that too as well. And this is the happy table. This table makes me happy. It just makes me smile. It's full of so many goodies to look at. This here is my, I call it my tickle tray. And what I do is I just, I fill it all up according to colors. And then when I do my art journaling, I take this to my table and then I just start collaging into my art journal. And it's just so much fun to go through all of these doodads. And I'll keep replenishing this for everybody that comes to the studio so they'll have lots of fun things that they can use in their art. Okay, and over here we have more drawers with more things. Just full, full, full. Again, like I said, you just never have enough for mixed media. And here 
I've got my paints and my glitters and my embossing powders and my rubber stamping inks and so on and so forth and stencils. I have lots and lots of stencils for the Butterfly Sisterhood when they want to come over to use that. I've got whole, whole drawer fulls of stencils. Oh, and over here on the pegboard, we've got punch out stamps that you can use and more inks and more papers and more goodies. And over here, I just want you to introduce you to my duck because this is not a serious place. Seriously, this is gonna be full of fun, laughter and play. That's my vision for this room. So you can Come and dig in the duck and see what's all in there. See if there's any surprises. And then almost to the roundabout full view of the studio. I just wanted to give you one last look at the studio area where you'll be working and playing and learning and having fun. So thank you again so much for stopping by and I look forward to meeting you in person and please just don't hesitate to contact me if you have any, any information, any questions. Okay, bye for now.